Hello everybody, back here again for our vlog a day, and today is Sunday the 14th, and today was a beautiful day, also Mother's Day, but the weather was gorgeous, we had a tiny little bit of rain left, Bruce left, we had a tiny little bit of rain, we went up um, to, we actually got this morning, got a couple things done, nothing major, went up to St. Augustine to hang out for the day, for Mother's Day, um, to where we did last year also, um, Richard, Karen's father, Karen and myself all did that last year. We decided to do it again. Um, on the way there, we caught a little bit of rain. Not much. Our state needs rain. It really does. Although, ironically, right now the grass is heavily dewed, which is a good thing. We need as much moisture as we can get. So, went ahead, um, got there. The rain had stopped, so we didn't have to worry about walking around in the rain and stuff, which was very, very helpful. Um, we spent, I don't know how many hours there. It's 12 bucks to park in, in uh, St. Augustine which is just a ridiculous amount of money to park a car for a few hours, but it is what it is. So we went around, um, ended up finding, um, Karen got an pendant. I think she got earrings last year. She got a pendant this year. It's like her Mother's Day gift from her father. Um, absolutely had a blast. It was just a good time. We hung around, saw a bunch of things, um, just walking out of the shops and stuff. Um, last year we did not do it, but this year I decided I wanted to go ahead and go over and hit the, um, the fort. So we went and checked out the fort. Um, also, each year when I go up there, I tend to forget my cigars for some reason. I have no idea why, but I forget my cigars, so I go up there, um, end up grabbing a cigar, a little cigar shop at the one end of the um, house, of the, I guess the strip, I guess you would call it, and about right, right next door to the oldest uh, wooden schoolhouse in America. And from there, we went on down. I smoked cigars. We wandered around the place. It did go out, unfortunately, at one point, so I had to relight it off matches, which is not the easiest thing to do on a fairly windy day. But we wandered in and out of the shops, um, had a beautiful, just beautiful day. Absolutely just very uneventful. Uh, Richard was getting very tired. Quickly, he does not do a lot of walking anymore. And Karen kind of told him he needed to get out and do a lot more walking because that's just not, it's not going to get any better for him if you don't continue to walk and keep, you know, getting more in our exercise. He's going to basically pull himself down and cause more issues as he gets older here. So but we had a great time, headed back. On the way home, um, we stopped, dropped Richard off, went on through, hit up the Walmart, did some grocery shopping, and ended up hitting up Aldi um, to grab some bananas, or actually some bread, I think, and some bagels. So from there, headed on back, and then just chilled out for the evening. We ended up making some country fried steak. I went for a run, Karen tossed them in the oven, and we had just a wonderful meal with some mashed potatoes left over from last night, and just had a great evening. Um, it was just, we were exhausted, we were tired. Karen's been sick. I still haven't fully recovered, I think, from my trip back to down from Iowa and just kind of really feeling it. I need to get just a day of just doing nothings to catch myself back up, but it is what it is. So I also need a new mattress. I'm got to get a new mattress. I'm waiting for that to actually come through. Karen found, uh, I think her boss found somewhere, has like super cheap mattresses online, whatever they were supposed to be looking at. So we'll see. Bruce. But um, went ahead and said to heck with it. Um, had a wonderful time. Chilled out. Went to go to bed to watch some Netflix and take a nap. I actually hit a sleep and it was just and if we said health, it threw in a comedy special and just went right to bed. So worked out wonderfully and had ourselves a safe and wonderful day. So hope you guys take care. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.